A massive snake with a body, like Mike Tyson's bicep, has been devouring Oklahoma cats as animal control seeks to track down the slithering serpent. News.com has learned a 13-foot python that a local animal expert says has a mouth the size of a foot has moved into an Oklahoma trailer park and been surviving on a steady diet of cats, possums, and rats. While the original source of the snake is not known, the leading theory is that it was a pet who either escaped or was abandoned before finding its way to Oklahoma City's Burntwood Mobile Home Park in June, Oklahoma News Channel K4 reported. It's since doubled in size, according to KWTVDT News 9. Animal control expert Trevor Bounds, who has been tasked with locating the python and compared it to Mike Tyson's bicep but 13 feet long, said to K4, the mouth on that thing is the size of your foot and when it opens up, you're going to be able to fit something pretty large in there. The constricting is what can be the dangerous part. You can't have small children or pets going near this thing that's why this should have been tackled a whole lot sooner. Things could have gotten much worse. Bound said that the snake is an albino reticulated python, which is one of the largest species in the world, who appears to have survived under a resident's home. We were using our thermal camera last week to find it but because it is cold-blooded, we had to just look for an outline of him," said Bounds. He said the snake has the potential to grow up to 24 feet long and that since it first appeared half of the neighborhood cats have disappeared. That home is pretty long and so getting two people in there in like a foot and a half crawlspace to fight a 13-foot snake is just impossible," said Bounds. When we looked underneath the floor at the home it created, that's when we started seeing a bunch of carcasses of large animals. There is an elementary school next to the mobile park home that has large areas with no gate to protect young students from a potential giant python attack. They have an animal that large, and I can imagine that each one of those cats put up a nasty fight. So, when it's been attacked that many times and to that extent, the nice non-aggressive pet snake we once knew is no more. This thing is dangerous now, said Bounds. The park staff told me to do whatever I can to take care of this problem. They were very adamant about getting this python out.